Hey guys, what's going on? It's Cable Line Network here. How's it going? I got a new jacket. Do you like it? Alright guys, now basically, um, in this video we're going to be talking about the CIA actually admitting, yes, admitting on Twitter that the unusual activity in the skies in the 50s was them. Yes, all the UFO sightings in the 50s was the CIA. They basically posted on Twitter. Now, a picture is going to be popping up right now. The CIA and the U2 program in the 1954 and 1974 era basically was, um, you know, involved in the development of the U2 spy plane. Now, basically, it explains how testing of the plane led to a massive increase in UFO reports. Not saying UFOs aren't real, but in the 50s, you know, seeing a lot of things flying in the air was still kind of new to everybody. So, you know, people were still getting used to it. Now, basically, um, they were testing a whole lot of flyings. Now, they were also saying the reason, no, swamp gas. Everybody was saying swamp gas. Like, legitimately, why do everybody always say swamp gas when they see a UFO sign? Like, legitimately, that swamp gas must be better than the weed I got because if it makes you see a goddamn spaceship in the air, I want some. Legitimately. All right, now, basically, in the mid-1950s, most commercial airlines flew between 10,000 and 20,000 feet, while military aircraft, such as the B-47, flew below 40,000 feet. Now, the reports were most prevalent in the early evenings of the pilots of airlines flying from east to west. When the sun dropped below the horizon, an airline is flying at 20,000 feet, the plane is in darkness. So, you know, of course, that would be massive UFO speculations. Hell, I remember, I remember actually on, like, fuck, I think it was yesterday, somebody was like, yo, look in the air and everything, because with lights and everything. Like, dude, that's a fucking plane. Like, people always think it's some type of UFO. So, not saying that it's not real. UFOs are real. Aliens are real. There is life on other planets. They're just not releasing it to us until, I guess, I don't know, I guess the populace can handle it. I mean, we can't even handle living with ourselves. I'll be honest, I wouldn't introduce a new civilization. To be honest, our civilization will basically hurt any other civilization that we find. What, what we got? We got all these stupid ass drugs. We basically got Nicki Minaj. We got Twitter. We got Facebook. We got Instagram. We got Snapchat. Do I need to say more? Yeah. I think them aliens are doing the right thing by staying as far away from us as possible. Probably nuking this planet would be a best option. Alright, now, talk to you guys later. This has been Cable Line Network here. Peace out. Max out. Now, put in the comments what do you think about all this. And also, we have a Minecraft server. By the way, guys, we also have a Minecraft server. Donating to it will actually allow you to get your epic Minecraft sculpture featured on this channel. Yes, now you can see the IPs are, you know, all over my news desk and in the, you know, monitor to my left right here. So, go check them out, guys. Cablecraft. Alright, talk to you guys later. Peace out.